Life Audio. A Prayer for God to Set a Guard Over My Mouth by Tiffany Tibalt, read by Leah Martin. Set a guard over my mouth, Lord. Keep watch over the door of my lips. Psalm 141.3 I remember a playground chant from my elementary school days. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. Thankfully, I don't have any experience with sticks and stones, However, I have broken a few bones in my life, and although they definitely do hurt, they do eventually heal. Words will never hurt me. This childhood chant is a lie. Words do hurt. Words often quickly take deep root inside our hearts as we pretend to be tough. Harsh words can tend to label us, limit us, and the pain of those words often lingers causing more harm than we even realize. Those words can cripple us from living the life that the Lord has for us. As Christians, we need the Lord's help with the words that come out of our mouths. Words have so much power in our life and in the lives of those around you. The words that we speak can build up or tear down. It says in Proverbs 18.21 that death and life are in the power of the tongue. It absolutely matters what we say, not only to ourselves, but to others. The most important thing that we can do is to make sure that we pray every day that God will guard our words and be honored in our conversations. Preparing our hearts and our thoughts before we talk with others will help us to be more cautious about the words that cross our lips. Psalm 141.3 was written by a man pleading for the Lord to help him with his words. He implored the Lord to set a guard over his mouth and to keep a watch over his lips. These are words that are used in a military sense. A guard will not allow anyone in or out of a walled city during times of war. A watchman would always be on alert, walking the top of the walled city looking for the enemy, protecting the people living their lives within the walls. Since our words have such a powerful effect on others, we desperately need the Lord's help. Psalm 19.14 says, Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my Redeemer. The Lord is there to help us to guard our mouths, to watch over our lips, and to guide our thoughts to ones that are pleasing to Him. Let's pray. Dear Lord, I pray that you set a guard over my mouth, that only words that honor you will cross my lips. May my words bring help and healing to others. May your peace and love flow through my words to the world around me. Lord, I pray that you keep watch over the door of my lips, that nothing comes out that is not uplifting and edifying. Please keep me from gossip, slander, and all untruths. May the words of my mouth be acceptable to you. In your name I pray. Amen.